what's up y'all welcome back to my channel if you're new here hey girl my name is Jayla don't forget to like comment hit that subscribe button so today we're gonna be talking about fragrance of course because you know that's one of my favorite subjects but we're gonna be talking about Zara fragrance so I have picked up some Zara fragrance because I actually have a Zara fragrance in my in my perfume collection I just feel like Zara perfume is not talked about enough because I feel like it's very long wearing, very potent, very strong. Like if you're somebody that wants to start building their perfume collection but doesn't want to spend all that money, um, I would definitely tap into Zara fragrance. A few Zara fragrances that I want to share with you guys. We're going to start with um, Gar Gardena. This is how she looks. Gardena, she was $12.90. $12.90, okay? Like I said, I already smelled them in store. So I know how they smell. This is how she looks. She's cute. The bottle's cute, I feel like. And I feel like this would be perfect for like traveling. Um, but wanna don't want to take all your expensive fragrances. And this is it should have the ounces on here. It doesn't, but it can be no more than two ounces. Um, I did also look it up on Zara's website. So Gardenia is an orange blossom with coffee notes and a fruity universal of peach and raspberry. So let's smell her. So I can give you guys like what I would wear, like what type of event I would wear it to. Mm. So definitely very fruity, but I feel like this perfume makes me feel like pretty. So I think I will wear this to like work or if I'm going to brunch with my girls, like any like daytime event, I would definitely wear it. And it's not like super bold. So I feel like definitely this is more for the daytime, but it's cute. I like her and I like, it's very like plain and simple, which I feel like you can't go wrong. So. Gardenia, get you some. Next we have Rose Gourmad. This is how she looks. This is the perfume I've been having. Um, it was like one of my first times that I shopped at Zara and I was like, I'm gonna buy this cause it smells good. And this I will say is gonna have you smelling like a grown man, but in a good way. I feel like every time I wear this, people are like, what are you wearing? Like this smells like cologne and I'm like, <laughs> and it's like strong i feel like because one day i had wore this and then i like headed to work and i feel like by the time i got to work an hour later i could still smell it it, it still felt like i just sprayed the perfume on so i feel like it's definitely long lasting and this perfume is very bold so i say that to say is i would definitely wear this like um to the club um, to a party yeah and i feel like this is unisex because <laughs> a man could definitely wear this fragrance but yeah and i don't know it doesn't smell nothing like rose to me so i don't know where they got the name from the luminous radiance of jasmine ethereal tenderness oh tenderness of penelope everything is there to adore and emphasize the rose with modern freshness and bold character far from incarnations of innocent impurity it symbolizes and animates an incompatible swell of feminine empowerment i like the way that subscription gave it i think i think that sums it up but yeah i get you some okay so next we're gonna talk about um if you're a vanilla girl this is definitely the fragrance for you and it is called the supreme vanilla I've already smelled her, so I'm not gonna open up and smell it again right now, but it is $35.90. Um, I feel like this is also a scent that you could wear to any type of event, um, night or day, just cause it's a uh, vanilla scent. I feel like vanilla, or even to bed, like when I say any time of day, I mean like after you showered and you're about to go cuddle up with your boo, you could wear this then, or if you're going to work or party, like, you could wear this any time of the day. Also reminds me of the Kalani vanilla, which I also have. 
but yeah this is very strong so for only oh i got this and this was only 17.90 but on the website it says 30 35.90 i guess this is the smaller version oh this one's a feminine and sophisticated fragrance that reveals all the splendor of madagascar vanilla an inky accord next to a pink sugar note underlining a rich and captivated captivating vanilla while the elegant notes of talking bean and cider wood leave an intense and unforgettable trail smelling notes oh they have smelling notes on this one smelling notes are tonkin bean cider wood madagascar vanilla and pink sugar with a tint accord intensity is medium to high so definitely intense so the last uh fragrance that i got is the hibiscus and this one was 20 1990 let's spray her because i like this one i like i feel like all zara's packaging is like very simple but so pretty and it says hibiscus here hibiscus yeah so this is like very very fruity but it i feel like this is another fragrance that's gonna make you feel very pretty yeah very fruity like it's gonna have you smelling like a snack it smells good so this one says where the hibiscus flower illuminates with illuminates this fragrance with its fruity and delicately musky characters a sun drenched sensational and mysterious flower a tropical citric cocktail opens this fragrance with a cheerful freshness evoking summer on an island in paradise in the middle penelope flower dunzins duns the fruity exotic and colorful sides of mango and passion fruit vanilla orchard and amber ultimately wrap up the fragrance in delicate and soothing creaminess interesting these descriptions are interesting but more like a summer scent like 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 the description said like when you're on a beach or in some sun like that's what this smells like and i feel like it also smells like something from bath and body works that i've smelled before can't put my finger on it though um, yeah so those are the zara fragrance y'all you cannot sleep on Zara fragrances. Like Zara got long lasting, bold fragrances. Like you do not have to go to the Macy's, Nordstrom, Sephora to get you some good fragrance. You could definitely tap into Zara fragrances. Um, and all of them are less than $20. So, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, hit that subscribe button. If there's any other Zara fragrance that I didn't mention that you guys like, please leave them below. Um, I would definitely love to hear your guys' thoughts. And yeah, I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.